you can also access quantization values right here in the region parameters box. So I've got the MIDI region selected. Let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit just so we can see the notes in the MIDI region in a bit more detail. Can you see how they're represented as little bars in the MIDI region itself? These are the individual notes. So if I go up now and adjust quantization values, oh, let's say to 16F, notice how some of these notes switch. Now the important thing to remember, however, is that when you adjust quantization values using the quantization menu in the region parameters box, you quantize every note in the region. Conversely, when you quantize using the piano roll editor itself, you have the ability to actually go in and select the notes that you want to quantize. And that's a big benefit. All right, I'm going to close this down and actually just quantize everything using the 16B quantization setting. There we go. You know what? I've made such a good drum loop here. I don't even want this original one, so I'm going to delete it right out of my sequence. Oop, I got a note that says, there are regions in this track. Delete the regions. OK. So that audio track is now gone, and we're using just our MIDI drum loop.